Hi everyone, Denise Hahn here from In My Blue Room Designs and I want to thank the Paper Crafters Library for having me. Um, I'm on the Graphic 45 design team and the project that I made for you today uh, is created with a lady's diary, uh, one of the newest collections from Graphic 45. And I've already included some pictures but I did want to share with you a quick tutorial on a couple of the embellishments that I made on this mini. And the first one is the dress. And uh, I'm going to bring it a little bit closer so you can kind of get a little idea of what it looks like. And um, the technique I use is to uh, crumple up the paper before I create the design. And um, I'm going to show you how I did that. And that kind of gives it more of a fabric look. And what I did is I just cut out a simple circle. And then I cut a little pie shape out of it and then cut another loose sort of circle in the middle. I um, just freehanded a bodice, you know, with some pencil and uh, cut that out too. And um, the next thing I did was I sprayed it with um, one of my favorite products, uh, Smooch Spritz, and the one I have picked out is called Ice Rink. And I'm going to go ahead and using my little color catcher, go ahead and spray this. And what it does is it makes the um, paper a little uh, damper and it crumbles easier. So I went ahead and just gave it a light mist. And then I'm going to go ahead and just crumple it up. And doing this, it um, gives your paper a lot more texture and again makes it a little more fabric like and putting the spray on first sort of helps you um, soften the paper a little to make it easier and you can crumble it kind of as much as you want or as little as you want um, you'll get less texture the more you crumble it and I think that's going to be just about enough. And I wanted to give the skirt a little more form, so I went ahead and um, just sort of did a, a back and forth fold around the dress. And I think I'll speed this up. You don't need to see all this. And there we go we have our little dress and um, again I don't like it to be perfect because I want it to be like it's fabric like it's flowing and uh, the next thing I did was simply used a little dot of hot glue glued that on wrapped a little belt around it um, hand wired the little um, hanger and uh, created my own cute little dress embellishment the next little technique I wanted to show you on this mini is um, a very simple one, um, but something that perplexed me for quite a while is I had all these white pins and white doesn't always really work and I kept looking for something. I tried paint, I tried Copic, I tried all kinds of markers and stuff, but I found what worked really great to color these is just um, some simple alcohol ink and I have some uh, Ranger alcohol ink and lettuce, which I used and it was just so easy just basically just like that put a little dot on it and it dries perfectly and really the only thing that uh, that like I said would stay on um, without rubbing off is this alcohol ink and so it's great you can buy you know a big box of these at the floral craft supply um, or at your local craft store and you know with your alcohol inks basically have an endless abundance of different colored pins to use um, so I hope you enjoyed these quick two little techniques and once again thanks for having me on the paper crafters library and hope you enjoy your time creating <laughs>